Hey friends, it's Connie from Say It With Simplicity and today I'm here and wanted to share a video with you about how to use your Silhouette Studio software to um, draw a heart. With Valentine's Day coming up you might want to use some hearts on your projects and you could buy them in the Silhouette store but this is a really quick and easy way to draw some hearts and um, I've used different ways to try to draw them before and I just feel like this is a really cool way and an uncomplicated process that I figured out and so I wanted to share it with you. So we're going to get started. I'm here in my studio and I'm going to grab an ellipse and I'm going to draw it in this area basically here so that I have some guidelines from my grid and maybe I'll make it a little shorter right here uh, how about there and so if you um, have this selected you can double click on it and now that takes you to your point editing panel let's just kind of drag that over here and I'm going to select the top point in this ellipse first and I'm going to use the down arrow key on my keyboard and I'm just going to bring this point down to uh, flat or just a little bit indented at the top and now you can see I have a handle on either side of this um, point and let me just undo that quick. I want to be able to move each of these handles independently so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use that corner and now when I move my points I can move those handles in or when I move those handles I can move them independently so I'm going to drag this handle up and to a point where I feel like I'm getting a nice heart shape here. And let's just settle on that for now. And now I'm going to drag this one up. And I want them to be sort of symmetrical, so I'm going to try to find the same point along my line here to drag them to and the same distance apart from the center line here. Okay, now if I hold down my shift key, I can select this point and this point at the same time. And now I can take the lower part or this handle here and I can drag it over. Let's just bring it down a little bit and then drag it over about that far and now we're going to do the same thing with the other one I'm going to bring it down just a little bit and drag it over Okay, so that's starting to look a little bit more like a heart here. I have a nice rounded edge. And now I'm going to click on the very bottom point. And I have a handle point on either side of my center point. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this and drag it towards the center. So that it meets up with my center point. 
And then I'm going to drag this other one over so that it meets up with my center point. And now I can click out of this and I have heart. If I click on it, I still only have four points. Um, so there's no need to simplify that. And now if I want to, I can go and color it. Um, I could open my transform panel. I could skew it if I wanted to. Better select it first, skew it if I wanted to. But we're just going to leave it there for today. And we have a nice heart that we drew quick and easy. And now I'm ready to use it on a project. So I can go up to my Save panel. And I'm going to save it to my library. And let's do just part one. Click OK. And now it's all set to go for a project. Thanks for stopping by today and watching this quick video with me. Um, this is one of my very first videos on YouTube, and so I invite you to um, leave some comments down below, like this video if you if you found it helpful to you. And I thank you again for stopping by today, and have a great day.